Yeonmi Park grew up in North Korea, a country so isolated and secretive that it's really hard to get onto some actual facts of what life there must be like. In 2007, she managed to flee the regime and after an arduous journey through several countries, she settled in America seven years later. Park is now a human rights activist, a spokesperson for other North Korean defectors and a writer. She told her story on Joe Rogan's and Lex Friedman's podcasts, on TED Talks and has her own YouTube channel. In this book, she describes her life and escape from North Korea in vivid detail. How the country was so poor that after a famine, the citizens had to donate their own feces to the government to be used as fertilizer for the crops. How she and her sister had to catch grasshoppers and other bugs during summertime and roast them over lighter in order to fill their bellies with just anything to eat. How her father rose to political fame before having a slip up and being deported to one of the many labor camps in the country, where he had to work himself to near death. The amount of pain Yonmi Park had to endure, the unforeseen plot twist in her life, it's all heartbreaking and yet gripping and fascinating. English is not her mother tongue, so don't expect beautiful prose or highly academic language in this book, that's not the point. Expect a glimpse into way of life so eerie to the Western world that you sometimes can't believe the people on the other side of the globe have to endure it every day. It's an important story that she told here, one of solitude, perseverance and courage. It quickly became one of my all-time favorite books, and I've recommended it to friends ever since. There are so many chilling stories in this book that it made me as humble as no other work of media had ever done before or after. This book deserves the full five stars, as it made me feel emotions I haven't felt from a book ever. To see more book reviews like this, check out this playlist right here. Thank you and see you next time. Ciao.